For this sign, I'm going to first engrave around the outsides of the elk using a fine bit about the size of this pencil. Once I'm done with that, I'll move to the outside and switch to a wider bit. I'll do a bunch of up and down movements, creating a texture that'll make the elk pop. All right, now that I got a solid outline, I'm gonna go back in with a smaller bit and grab everywhere I couldn't get with my bigger bit. And here's the size comparison between those two bits. Here's the one I was using earlier, and here's the one I'm using now. Now that I got a solid outline, I can go back in with a wider bit and do all the up and down movements. As you can see, there's a couple places that the paint came off. To fix this, I'm going to use a little bit of black paint and just paint over it with a paintbrush. Also notice on the elk right here that the spray paint bled through the wood. That'll be alright as long as we use a darker stain at the end. Alright, as you can see, there's polyurethane that's still white. If it stays white like that, that means it's going to dry white. So what I like to do is grab the air compressor and blow these out. And that's it for this project. If you like this video, please leave a like and make sure to check out this video right here.